everyone! It's Gianna Lamy from Zoo Crypto, where we're keeping the loop on all the latest trends and news of crypto and blockchain technology. Together, we're building a crypto movement that fights climate justice and economic empowerment. Today, I have some exciting news for the Cardano community and for fans of Cody. It's on the Dejad stablecoin. Here's the article. The latest Dejad updates. Cody is the official issuer of the Dejad stablecoin. That's the algorithmic stablecoin for Cardano. And they've had a lot of developments in the past few weeks. So I want to go over them for you. The first one is extensive script optimizations to increase throughput. This is really significant since it's helped cut down about 60% of execution budget fees. Another big update is that the ADA exchange rate acquisition module has been updated and now it considers at least six external sources for redundancy and security reasons. So now the exchange rate on the blockchain will be updated when only three out of the six external sources have responded. They've also improved their capabilities to test and deploy new versions. Currently, about 80% of test objectives have been tested and they automatically test now with the Jed smart contracts. And finally, on-chain code has been finalized with a reference to audit mediations. So those are the main developments for Dejad for the past few weeks. They've also seen a lot of new partnerships. This includes Wing Riders, they're an AMM DEX built on top of Cardano. There's also Jara Network, an open finance portal, Cardano Warriors, a massive multiplayer on-chain role-playing game. And they also have Coquito Protocol. They're a spinoff from Singularity Net, a multi-chain decentralized AI platform. We have a bunch of other videos too on Cody and Dejad and their partnerships. I'll link the Cardano playlist up above if you want to check them out. You might be wondering what's coming next for Dejad. Currently, they're waiting for it to launch on the mainnet for Cardano. Um, right now, they're waiting for the off-chain code and specific libraries to synchronize and converse with the Cardano node. Once the off-chain code has been updated to properly handle Cardano node 1.35.x, then it'll be ready to launch on the public testnet and then the mainnet. Let me know, though, what you think in the comments below. There's been a lot of new developments, and I think we're going to see a lot more partnerships for Cody and Dejad. But that's it for us today. Feel free to like, subscribe, and comment your thoughts. Feel free to share this with your friends if you enjoyed this content, and I'll see you next time, everyone. Bye.